Hi guys, I am Mohammed Nawazi Abu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. So a few months back, I have uploaded a video AWS Serverless RDS Python. That is how can we connect a AWS Lambda function to a RDS database. That is basically I have used Postgres database for this one. So in this particular video or tutorial, I have used Ubuntu machine and I try to create all packages in Ubuntu machine. Okay, but if you guys look on the comments session, we can see that a lot of people are struggling with few errors and they are getting this particular no module found exception. So people may be getting this kind of exception maybe due to two reasons. One is they may have like mismatch in the Python versions. So they have created packages maybe in Python 3.11 and when they uploaded that to AWS Lambda functions, they created AWS Lambda with maybe like Python 3.9 or something like that. So in that case, you may be chance of getting this particular error. And another scenario is something like the people are following this particular video and they were actually they are using Windows operating system in that scenario. So they may be getting this particular situation. So I am here to discuss how can we connect or how can we solve this particular issue for Windows users. Okay. So for that, the things are a little different, okay, when we talk about Windows. So what we need to do in this particular scenario, we have to install, pip install, maybe let me copy this one, so that, that, that may be the easy thing. Okay, here I have to use AWS package specific to this one now let me create this one okay so this is done so let me open my visual studio code you can see that i have a this this code is same this code is the same code okay so we have a additional package for aws see so what we need to do we need to see this particular folder so let me open this one so we need to see these these files okay these two are my environment files so i have selected these two three folders and one python file let me see it Okay, so this is done. Now let me open my L, my AWS console. Okay, AWS Lambda. Let me create a new Lambda function here. Okay, can give name. Yeah, giving name is a problem. Maybe I can give uh, Lambda Windows function. Now let me select Python 3.9. Okay. Create function. Maybe four to five seconds it may take. You can wait. Yep. So that is done. Now let me create a test here first. You can see the me test okay save then test okay so this is working fine now what i can do i can upload the zip file okay so let me drag and drop this one state handler let me drag no no drag and drop will not work okay fine so let me upload this. So this is actually more than 10 MB. So we have to upload through AWS S3. So, but I'm trying directly, okay. So this is upload is in progress. So since it is size is very high, we may not able to edit that one. Okay, here, see, we cannot able to edit it from here okay because its size is too high 
but we can do the rest of the testing and everything okay so here what we need to do we need to edit because our file name is state handler right so this has to be edited state handler now save it okay so this part is done now let me test it just run the test okay execution is success so we are getting the result so this is the result that we are getting this is actually a dummy data okay so we are getting the result okay yep i believe like this video will help for like those windows users okay yep so that is all about in this video please do like and subscribe have a nice day bye bye